I think I started to understand this when I decided at one time to learn from the scriptures about the atonement. I'd heard about the atonement. I'd heard, heard about it in my home. I'd heard about it in Sunday school and primary and young women classes. I'd heard about it in seminary, but I didn't really understand how it applied in my life until some things started becoming difficult for me. And I opened my scriptures, started in 1 Nephi, and I thought every time I read something that might point me to the atonement, I'm going to mark that. I didn't even know what I was looking for sometimes, but I wanted the Lord to teach me. I started to learn through that question, what is the atonement and how does it apply to me? I began to get pieces and piece together how the Lord felt about his children and the price he paid for each of us. That I, I began to understand what he meant when Isaiah says, with the Lord's voice uh, talking about him, that he was a man of sorrows and acquainted with grief. And, and I, that sentence just stayed in my mind. The Lord was a man of sorrows and acquainted with grief. He knows us and he knows our trials. That's the first thing that comes to my mind now when something becomes difficult, that the Lord knows about sorrow and grief. And I might feel completely alone in this trial, but I'm not alone because I know he's acquainted with how I'm feeling.